Hey everybody, it's Cammie here. Um, I'm coming to you today because I have something that's heavy on my heart. Some of you may know um, a fellow YouTuber named Andrea Mills. And some of you may not. And if you don't, I encourage you to please go over there and, um, and check out her channel. She, um, she is a very sweet, Christ-centered, homeschooling mom with a bunch of kids and a loving husband. And everything that she does is centered around her home. They do everything in their home. They have a small home that they've never wanted to move from. They've just, um, they've just, they love it there. And they love everything that, that happens there. Their school happens there. The husband's business happens there. Um, they have church there. But, and we were out of town last week, and so I'm kind of coming to this a little bit late because I didn't realize that all of this was going on. But she, just over the weekend, she was pregnant with um, a little boy that they named Cyrus, who she, she, she lost at 14 weeks. And some of you, none of you know this about me, but in 1998, my husband and I had a full-term son who, um, who was stillborn. So that right there, that right there just broke my heart. But then her husband, Tom, in updates, they found out that she has complications. She was found to have an aggressive form of cancer. And the way I understand it is that the, they don't know where it's originating from, but the cancer is in her biliary duct between her gallbladder and her liver. And um, they're giving her just a couple of days literally to live. And um, they said it's an aggressive form. This has just happened just suddenly i mean just the last time thing that i had watched they were having one of their um where you have you know you watch as they're having dinner and they were at a conference and having they had stopped and got kentucky fried chicken we're at a picnic area and then this i mean it's just and if it's overwhelming for all of us i can't even i can't even imagine I can't even imagine what her husband and children are going through. Um, they need prayer. They need they need prayer now, not next week or two weeks. We need to, as a YouTube community, those of us who are um, who believe in the power of prayer, who believe in miracles who believe in God's grace, who believe in, um, you know, by his stripes we're healed. We need to start now, and we need to pray for this family. If you have a, a um, church family, please put her, call now as soon as you finish this video. Please call and put, put her and the family on your church's prayer chain. We need to start a prayer chain here on our channels. If you are faith-based, we need to pray for them, but we need to get the word out too that they are in they are in urgent need of prayer now, today, right now. Um, her dying wish is to get home to her family so that she can be with her kids. She wants to die at home. That breaks my heart. That this is what this mother who has been I'm sorry you all know where I'm going with this this is just urgent it's urgent she's the last thing I saw was they were leaving at one point they couldn't get medication for her pain at the house 
but I think now they've got that taken care of. At one point, she was at, hos at a hospice room. It's all moving so fast, y'all. Everything is moving just so, so fast. And we just need to, just please, if you have a channel, I am, I'm starting this as a prayer chain for us to, for us to go out and please remember them on your channel and ask others too. If you have a home uh, church, please get her on your prayer chain there. And if you are on Facebook prayer chains, wherever you have a prayer where there are warriors, prayer warriors who can pray for her and pray for her family, pray for her husband as he tries to figure all this out. Pray, pray for wisdom for the doctors. Pray for her extended family. It's hard on the extended family too. Pray for those little babies of hers. Her youngest is like a year and a half. She has children. Her oldest is out of, I think he's he's not out of high school, but he's close. And he helps the father in their computer business. And the youngest, they have children all the way ranging down to the little one named Hannah. And please, I just ask you to please pray for them. Please join me as I pray for them. My heart is broken for this family. I have never met her, but I feel like I know her. Because if you if you watch, if you watch her videos, you will too. You you feel like I know her when you. I mean, because she um. She shares her home with you. I'm going to close this out, but please, I just ask if you have a channel, once again, please, please pray. Please ask your, ask your subscribers to pray. I'm asking my subscribers, please pray for them. And channels, please, let's start this. Let's get it going. Let's, I know there's some other channels who've already started praying for, but let's, let's do this. Let's get the word out. Let's do this like you would your prayer chain. Um at church or on facebook or wherever you know the more that we pray the more people pray and you know it's not gonna hurt and if and if if she goes if she does go on to be with with the lord in the next couple of days we need to pray for her family we need to pray for them as they grieve we need to pray for those babies as they've lost their mother and her husband but let's pray for a miracle also. Let's pray that the doctors are just, you know, that they just, that their mouths are open because they can't figure out how in the world. But we know, we know. And um, we need to pray for wisdom for all of the healthcare providers in, involved. And, um, uh, and we just need to pray for each other, too. There's a lot of people that this have touched. And, um, you know, let go of the small stuff. Because this, kind of, this is the kind of stuff that, that matters. All right, I'm going to close out. Thank you all. Thank you all for listening to me and, and for joining me in prayer for this sweet Christian family. I'll talk to you all later. Bye-bye.